here. I'm going to turn on this Amiga. And we hear the sound of the hard drive and the fan. But there's another thing. Ah, that is a good sign to listen to. And that is, once things are set up and the hard drive is doing its thing and it is doing its thing, you should hear the occasional gentle ticking of the floppy drive. This is a good sign. So if you were out somewhere and you found an Amiga 2000 with or without a hard drive and you turned it on and you saw things flashing on the power thing and you weren't sure if things were seeming to be okay, if you heard this little gentle, gentle, gentle clicking inside the floppy drive, that is a good sign that it is looking for a disk, it is ready for a disk, it is happy to receive a disk, and that the machine is probably working. So, easier to hear, I know, without the hard drive and the fan spinning up. But just that, there it is. There it is. There it is. Just that little bitty is a good sign. So keep that in mind if you're out at a flea market and you got a way to plug in something you find, listen for the drive. And if you have to, put your ear right up to it. Mind you, any Amiga, depending, is not a bad thing because parts are good. But it's nicer when they work. Enough for now. Bye for now.